seven days. I'm teaching the Hikam of Ibn Ata'illah part two. We already did part one, and now I'll be doing part two of the Hikam of Ibn Ata. The Hikam of Ibn Ata is one of the most important books, I would say, in all of Islamic scholarship, particularly the subject matter of Tasawwuf. If you have to, if you had to choose two works for Tasawwuf, you pretty much I I would believe that the vast majority of scholars would choose Ihya Ulum al Din and Hikam ibn Ata'illah al Skandari. Those are the two books that I, if you had to pick two books, you'd pick those two books. And really, it's one and one A, right? It's really very hard to choose which one you would rather have because the Hikam, although it's shorter, you can extrapolate so much from the Hikam of ibn Ata'illah al Skandari. So those are my two classes, and let's now 